Is that an elevator? Yeah. Hey, pull that door down. some advice. Oh my god. Just think about the good parts to me. The good parts? Yeah, like you run faster. You're more focused. Oh, you don't feel pain as much. Every bad feeling, your palms sweating, your heart racing, they're all signs you're actually strong. So when you feel afraid, you should think about how your body is getting ready for it. Only when weak may I carry my true strength. That's a profit thing? Yeah. Hmm. I thought you were anti-electricity and all that sinful old world stuff. There are exceptions. Especially for soldiers. That's convenient. Here's a note. Pass along. The truce is over. They ambush one of our groups. We need to show our strength. Gather a handful of your stronger soldiers and go deep into their territory. Target any wolves who come across. There is no age restriction to the message we must deliver. Oh. So, you like this prophet even though her followers want to kill you in her name? She wouldn't want any of this. Her writings don't have violence in them. You should tell that to your people. We weren't stoning or hanging people until after she died. We're taking her words and twisting them. Read the text. Okay. Here. What the fuck is that? That's the bridge. Lev. Follow me. Fuck. You go slow. I don't know if I can do this. It's not as bad as it looks. cross this regularly? Yeah. You're lying. I'm not. I mean, it's not the most popular route. Oh my god. Just try not to look down. Strength. <laughs> Cold. Cool. What? Never mind. What's going on between you and your friend Owen? Oh my god, Lev, now? It seemed really awkward. Just go! Impressed by me? Not yet. Why? Why? You'll see. <laughs> Holy shit, Lev! It's gonna be okay. Eyes on me. Shit. <laughs>
terrified of this. And don't quote the prophet to me. Heights never scared me. It does. The ocean. Dogs. Holy fuck. Oh my god. Almost there. Shit. Hey, look! You can see the hospital now. Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Focus on me! I can't do this, Lev. I can't do this! Yes, you can! I can't. You're going to. Come on, true strength. True strength. True strength. Yes. Yes, kill Abby. Always kill Abby. Okay. Even if you have to, like, oh shit. Yeah, this would make me shit my pants in real life, most likely. You can make it. Guess who's back? It's Joshy. Oh no. Yeah. Knew that one was kind of coming. Guess who's back? Back again. Joshy's back. Okay. Tell a friend. Yeah, that that fall was definitely intended in the game. Okay. Where to now? I don't know. What do you mean? This is the right building, but I've never been to this part of it. The bridge drops us off at the back of the building. This is new to me. Okay, well... Let's see if we can find our own way down. Oh, I'm doing good. I'm just ready to get this game over with and... stream some League of Legends. Ooh. If that's the worst of it, we got off lucky. Maybe it wasn't luck. Maybe it was. Some wolves believe in God. I've heard them pray. Well, I don't. If I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die for me. Then what are you doing here? Why did you come back for us? Think about stream later. What you gonna stream, Joshy? What? We don't owe us anything. I just needed to lighten the load a bit.
Apex or Call of Duty or Fortnite. One of those. Streaming it on the Xbox. That's what you got, right? If my memory serves me correctly. Alright, we check that bathroom. We open this bathroom, I should say. How do you feel about the old, uh, old mixer shutting down? Wait, didn't that, like, shut down today? Oh, alcohol. Perfect. This was the other side of the weight room, right? Yeah. It was just nice for Twitch to have some competition. Ooh, a safe. Alright, so we gotta find a piece of paper that lets us get into that fucking safe. I have a feeling those stairs aren't it. It was on the 22nd of June. I didn't know if they officially shut it down then or if it was like officially closed on the 1st. I think they announced it on the 22nd. I know that for sure. Aha, there's going to be our code. I think. Please don't leave valuables lying around your shift. You have an employee safe to clean the closet. The code is the same as the Wi-Fi, Cheryl. So we gotta find the Wi-Fi password. Oh, thank you for the host, man. Um, I can't see that when I'm on the PlayStation that you hosted, but thank you for hosting, dude. I appreciate you. At least I don't think, hold on. Let me pull up a different part of the app on my phone. Yeah, it doesn't show uh, hosts when I do it on my PlayStation, but thank you, dude. I appreciate you. Alright, so now we're gonna find something for the Wi-Fi password. There's gotta be something that says, like, Free Wi-Fi password is this. That's why I enable Nightbot and other bots. Yeah, I don't have Nightbot set up. I should probably look into that. Alright, where can I find the Wi-Fi password? Free Wi Fi. Here we go. Twelve eighteen seventy nine. Did it. Nice. And it's got alcohol. Okay. I should probably make some pipe bombs, honestly. They're convenient to have. 52. Okay. Um. Move fast while holding a hostage. Craft more effective health kits is probably going to be the winner. Ooh, 
Ooh, that's good though. Oh. Oh, I can't. Fuck. I'm gonna hold. Wait, I think I can pick that up now, right? Here's our way down. If we get to the street, right by the hospital. Just a body. One of yours? No. Check out the clothes. Here. Looks dark down there. Oh, I see how this works. Sub Victor. Had orders to clear out this building. They were missing. Um, and I'm, um, I'm um, dead. The nest was bigger than we anticipated. Tried to blow them up. The fucking detonators were faulty. Figures that the fucking federal incompetence is what's going to kill me. Welcome back, Joshi. Love, are there infected in this building? We always take elevators down to the bottom, so I don't know. Oh, they're definitely infected in this building. Fuck. <laughs> yes, yeah, suck it. Okay, so that's full. You guys not believe in gas masks? We were on the run. Let me see what I can find. Stay here. <clears throat> Back up. All the way. If you die, I'll be stuck here. You better start praying I make it. This is where shit goes. Okay, gas mask. Gas mask. Uh-oh. That's no bueno. That is no bueno at all. No moss. No, no moss. <laughs> I 
I bet that's what I'm going to have to do. Holy shit, this building's fucked. Yeah, it's uh, not like a Minecraft creeper. They're a little bit more deadly. A little bit scarier. All right, so I've swept this room, which leads me to there. Fuck. I'm Oh, God. Oh, this guy's gonna... Yes. Looks good. Alright, back to lab. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Fucking runners. And runners are really good at not being fucking heard. <laughs> ship it, ship it, ship it. Smack it. Where's another one? Ooh, there's another one. Where you at, bitch? So those are runners, um, they're a type of form of the zombies that are in this fucking game. So not only are you fighting, so, okay, how do I explain this? You start the game off as Ellie. Probably the best way for me to explain this to you, we'll st I'll, I'll just explain the first game. I can probably just go ahead and fucking like loot everything while I'm doing this too. Um, so the first game, you 
you start as a character named Joel. And... Um... It's only you and your daughter, and it's when the outbreak happens. Um, and you're in Texas, and it's like this big pandemic ordeal, and then like... You know, people start like turning, just like, you know, like any like zombie type game. Um, and like, so you're with your daughter and like, you're, you know, you're just like trying to get out of like a super crowded area. And then like you get caught by um, like a U.S. Army type person and he's like we got two here don't seem infected and then he's like sir but there's a little girl and he shoots and ends up killing the daughter um and then Joel's brother comes shoots the guy and then they're on the fucking run uh it cuts like 20 years forward into the future I'm gonna pause it while I explain this um and then eventually uh you get asked to smuggle something across the country and the thing that you get asked to smuggle is this girl named Ellie. So, Ellie got bit by these things. They're called clickers. Is basically what you turn into. Um, it you know just like a zombie that like kills you. Yeah, they they shot they killed like an eight-year-old girl um and it's like the first 20 minutes of the fucking of the first one and then so you find out that ellie had been bitten and everything but she had been bit like three weeks prior and she never turned so she's somehow immune um and so you basically why did they? Because they were just killing everybody trying to stop the spread of the infection, pretty much, is what it, like, appeared to be. Um, and then, like, everything's under, like, martial law. Um, you know, you, you move Ellie across the country to this, like, vigilante group named the Fireflies. And because they think by testing Ellie they'd be able to make like a vaccine for um to where people would be immune against the clickers that way that they could like wipe them out without you know causing more and then like restoring everything back to like a normality and uh, Joel finds out the only way that they can use Ellie as if they kill her and he just traveled across the country with her and he bonded with her like he like she was his daughter and it's either Joel lets Ellie get killed or he fucking stops it and he decides to stop it and he kills the fucking doctors and everybody in there gets Ellie while she's unconscious and fucking dips um so in this game Ellie's older um, and they live in Jackson, Utah. I think it's Utah. Yeah, Jackson, Utah. They have, like, a town that's, like, kind of normality. Um, they go on runs throughout the air, like, you know, throughout the surrounding area to clear out clickers. Um, and they go in, like, two people groups, two person groups. Um, and, you know, Ellie, at first, you don't think Ellie knows why like cause Joel just told her that like you know there was gonna be no way to find a cure so he basically lied to her saying that like they were gonna kill you to f to find the like the vaccine the cure and he just couldn't like he was selfish and he couldn't fucking do it well they're out on a run and Joel meets Abby which is the character I'm playing as now which is why every time she dies I fucking laugh um and like he runs into her and she's with a group she's with Owen and Mel like the two people that were there earlier 
and a bunch of groups, and they're actually out hunting Joel. And then, like, Abby causes a stir, causes, like, a big horde of clickers to, like, chase after them. They get back to where Abby's team's at to find out who Joel is. And they beat the fuck out of him with a golf club. Well, Abby specifically does. And Ellie goes to try to find him, finds him, and Ellie watches Joel die to the hands of Abby with, like, her group of goons around and she, like, beats him to death with a golf club. And Ellie watches. And so then, um, Ellie, the first part of this game, which I've already done, um, you play as Ellie and her girlfriend, Dina. And basically, you travel to Seattle to kill the people that killed Joel. So... I've already seen, so like, it it's a three day thing. So what happened was like you like one by one like you're traveling to try to find Abby. You're not finding Abby, and you're fucking you're killing clickers, and you're killing wolves, which is what Abby's militia group is called. And like you recognize the people that are there, and you kill them one by one. You actually kill Owen, and Mel. Um, and then, like, Abby busts in to the place where, like, they're, like, stationed at. And then, like, there's, like, a flashback. And then you, then you start to play from day one in Seattle when, um, did you know they have a new Twitch emote? Nice. Um... And you find out that one of the doctors, like, the main doctor that was going to kill Ellie was Abby's dad. Um, and then, so, like, basically you're playing, like, the time frame that Ellie is in Seattle trying to kill Abby. So right now I'm playing, like, the same three days, but through Abby's point of view. Because right now, like, the last time that we saw Ellie... Abby had her at fucking gunpoint and it's like ready to fucking blow her brains out so this is where we're at and then there's also the Seraphites which are Scars which is a different uh, militia group so to say um, that have like a civil war with the wolves and so as you're playing both characters um you have different humans to dodge, and you have the clickers and everything to dodge as well. There. We got this. Did you see a way down? No. Okay. What about what? Is that a fire hose? Lev, come get this down. Coming. Yeah, and she's actually helping Scars right now, so... Yeah, Abby's kind of a comp, but Joel killed her dad, so she's on, like, her own vengeance. Th it's weird, because you just get uh, super attached to Joel and Ellie, if that makes sense. Because you've already played, like, one full game with them, and then she's introduced. And... I'm gonna head down. Be careful. Oh, God. There's gonna be, like, a fucking bloater or something. Fucking re... Oh, there's definitely going to be a fucking bloater. Now what? Follow me. May the 
Shaker, be calm. Alright, so he's got ammo and a note. And the note says, Avery, the Black Ray Hotel contains a large group of infected, likely the ones that spilled out of the hospital. We need you and your crew to bring down the supports from the inside out. Use the supplied explosives and remote detonators. Good luck. Uh, bloaters are the biggest, strongest form of infected. And they take quite the fucking punch. Which is why when you said your ass at this game earlier, I laughed and I was like, oh, this isn't even a hard part. I just went about it wrong. God. Yeah. And, I... and then occasionally your flashlight battery will do that and you'll have to shake your controller to pop it back up. How much do I have? Okay. Guess it's gonna be this. Alright, 13 pills. 13 pills and I get what I want. Tell me about it. I just fucking jumped. Yeah, that's kind of how it feels playing this game. Fucking drop. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay. So <laughs> that's not what you're supposed to do, apparently. <laughs> oh well. So let me get a better look. Okay, so I have to. All right, that's better. God. More floors down. Do you think we have to go? I don't know. It's a big building. Yeah. Duct tape. There's definitely something on the other side of that fucking wall. Lev, Libby, Lily, whatever your fucking name is, you're kind of in the way. Although, that might jump out and get me. Especially with that being bait. Oh no. Wait. 
What's up, you little bitch? Oh man. Well, I am so glad we took this shortcut. Even though we're stuck with all these demons? That's a joke, Lev. Oh. Yeah, I jumped like a bitch, not even gonna lie. Man, I was hoping there'd be something in this fucking bathroom. Oh, but what is this? That's a fucking flamethrower! Ooh! Oh, the game... Man, fuck you, cunt. Give me all this shit. That's a flamethrower, though. Three-way. Uh, be right back. Quick bathroom break. Oh, this guy? Come here, beast. Come here, buddy. Come here. Well, this one's Lola. Come here, Lola. Come here, baby. You're okay, baby. This is Lola. She's my old girl. Say hi. Say hi, Lola. And then... Come here, big boy. Come here. Come here. Yeah, come here. Ah, this is Beast. This is the puppy. He's a poodle. You know why I got a poodle? Bitches love poodles. Alright, hop down. Hop down. Alright, good boy. Good boy, good girl. Those are my pupperooskies. A Great Dane? Great Danes are good dogs. Great Danes are great dogs. They just have short lifespans. Seven to eight years on average. And they take a lot of fucking food. Alright. Well, I guess it was worth that jump scare. 
Yeah, suck it. Tell him his eyes see too clear. I would find a way without you. Tell him his eyes see too clear. That mistake was gold, I know. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Do you have like merles or like what color? What what gender? Alright, so over there and over there. I don't know where the fuck Lev went. Okay. Not going that way. Oh, I have no shifts. We're gonna test this bad boy out, though. See ya, bitch. <laughs> 10 out of 10, would use again. Driving with it. It's impressive. Yeah, it is. Let's get out of here. It was a boy, he was dark, dark, navy blue. Yeah, I like was it a Merle? Lola's Lola's like a light blue. And she's got some Merle in her when you shave her. Two years old and big, yeah. I mean, Danes think they're lap dogs, but their size says otherwise. But then again, any dog's a lap dog if you're not a little bitch about it. Like, Beast is the biggest dog that I've had in years, and he is actually the only male dog that I've ever owned. Uh, I, I just, I don't know why. I prefer female dogs. They seem to, like, bond better with men. Um, they don't seem as fucking rowdy. Oh, I definitely need to <laughs> take that free health. Get, get, get that paper. Wait. Is there more to explore that I didn't see? No, it was just the way I was looking at things. I guess I could hop down. cat that is a bitch bitch once you pet her she fucking bites and claws your arm yeah that's a cat man that's why <laughs> that's why I, I don't fuck with cats that was a good documentary too don't know if you've heard of it or seen it that sounds like a fucking bloater whatever is up ahead sounds fucking mean Yep, that's a fucking bloater. Later, bitch!
Yeah, that's a thick bitch. Okay. So the whole point of this room was to come kill a bloater and get three fucking pieces to upgrade a gun. Lovely. Well, I guess that bloater's not running around. And I guess we cross. I hate this. Me too, Abby. Me too. Why did it sound like I just heard a fucking clicker? Yep. I hate this building. Keep going down. We're almost at the street. What's worse, a clicker or a runner? A runner is definitely worse. Um, like, there's different forms of everything, too. So, like, there's ones that are that still look human. Um, uh, and then, like, the next level up is a clicker. Um, so, like, the ones that still look human... They they take like the least amount of hits to kill. Um, they are the easiest to like sneak up behind. Um, and then like if you like when I hit R one, which is just like on a PlayStation controller, um, the front right bumper, um, I go into this listening mode, right? And, like, if you hear, like, clickers or, like, the human form, you can, like, see them through walls. That Like, the same way that I could see the bloater. Um, I don't even think that was an actual bloater. Oh, fuck. Wait, where am I supposed to fucking go? Down? Onto the mattress? Ooh. Okay. Pills? Ooh. Hills. Um. Anything? No. Okay. Um. And the runners, as you saw, they're they're not they're a little bit weaker than like a clicker is, but you can't fucking sneak up on them, and they don't fucking detect through this shit. Like they are just on a whole nother fucking level of fuck you. Like, they, they're fast. They, they grow in this shit in the walls. And they sneak a lot. Is it true that Isaac took down the old guard? Fedra, yeah. I hear he tortures people. Let's not talk about this now. Okay. Have I hear... You ever tortured people? Let's focus on getting out of here. Uh, the answer to the question: Has Abby ever tortured people? Yeah, she fucking has. 
Okay, so it's not that way. Okay, progress. Live, you doing all right? Yeah. <clears throat> if I'm being honest, not my best day. Oh, fuck. We are still a shit ton away from the street. What the fuck? Alright, full on health kits. I'm going to... This is probably going to be fucking needed. Incendiary shotgun rounds. Over pipe bombs. Uh, yeah, so I, I think, I think runners are worse, even though they're easier to kill, because they're usually, like, more in packs, too, and you can't, like, just sneak up on them and shiv them. And fuck me. Fuck me, fuck me, fuck me, fuck me. you heard him on the other side of this door that's going to be stuck. Oh, uh, hold on. Fuck this. So that's a clicker. There are too many demons. Just keep looking for a way out of here. One, two, three, four, five. That we're seeing. And look at the end of the fucking hallway. Yeah, that's a bloater. Where you at, bitch? Come get you some. That killed it. Woo! Yeah. We did it. We killed that big demon. Yeah, we did. Yeah, Come we on. did. We totally did.
Later, Joshy. What a do though. What a fucking do though. Bitten back there? No. Oh, were you? No. Your nose sounds like a maybe. I'm clean. I promise. It was just a lot. Well, you did good. What is that? A quarter. A quarter of what? <laughs> what? Take your mask off. Thank you. The hospital. It's right there. We did it. We sure did. You see that elevator right there? Let's get out of here. Let's not tell the others about what happened. I don't want Yara to worry. You're a good brother. Can I ask you a question? Okay. Do you regret shaving your head? You're not supposed to have regrets. Love. I wish I just ran away. Then Yara wouldn't be caught in all of this. She'd be back home, taking care of her mom. Does your mom need taking care of? She's our mom. Our baby.
May she guide you. Staying here, yeah? Yeah. Professor? I'm a wolf! Don't shoot! It's me! It's Abby! Abby? It's Abby, shit! Is she alone? Open the gate! Hey guys. Jesus, you swim here? The boat got fucked. I need to grab some medical supplies. I'm doing a thing for Isaac. We're moving all these assets to Isaac. What does he need? Um, I can't talk about it. It's something away from the fob. Well, everything's getting moved out and packed up. Take a look, see if anyone's got what you need. Hey, is Nora around? Yesterday she said she was shipping out here. Just left the last transport, but she'll be back. Okay, thanks. Who are they still getting new recruits? Maybe they're brainwashing all the trespassers to enter the city. What you got there? Splints, tongue depressors, bedpans. Is there anything surgical? Saw some stuff like that inside a while back. Thanks. You still clear in this place? Yep, one floor at a time. Still got supplies in there? <laughs> oh, for sure. Lock hey. Abby. They got you out here, too? Yeah, what a haul. <laughs> I need some medical supplies. Can you put me where I'm supposed Abby. to? Abby, just checked in with Isaac. He wants you back at the farm. Let me talk to Isaac. Talk to him in person. We're going back for the next shipment. Sorry. What are you doing? She's been AWOL since yesterday. Give me your hands. Okay, your shoulder. Nora. Well, I never thought I'd see you on Isaac's bad side. You find no one at the aquarium? I talked to Manny. I need some medical supplies. Why? What, what happened to him? Compartment syndrome. Bashed forearm. 
You're not treating him, are you? <laughs> Mel. We don't have a lot of time. Jesus. Most of these supplies have been packed and shipped already. What? We haven't cleared out the lower floors yet. Would they have what I need? Yeah, probably, but... It's rough down there. I'll be fine. You get caught. I had nothing to do with this. Of course. All right, come on. <sighs> Compartment syndrome. Fuck. Yeah. Well, he's lucky he's dating a doctor. All doing okay? Fine. She was so fucked up after Isaac talked to her. Isaac talked to her? After he found out you left the base. Isaac interrogated all of us. He was rough on her. Did anyone talk? No. Nora! Where are you two going? To grab Abby. The boat's ready to head out. Well, I still got uh, boxes on the third floor. Can you two bring them first? Boat's pretty full. Come on, I don't want to be here all day. Fine. Thanks. They're gone. And you're okay? Always. Well, Manny's been worried to pick about you. You know I'm here? I bet he will soon. So what's Owen's plan once Mel gets at Arma? Um... He's been talking about Santa Barbara. Hold up. All clear. Okay, anyway. I know Owen can't stay. He's talking about Santa Barbara. He knows that's all bullshit, right? God, I feel so bad for Mel. Yeah. <clears throat> Me too. All right. These floors have the ICU, the trauma center, and a few surgical suites. Sounds perfect. There's a reason we haven't touched this area yet. It was ground zero for the whole city. Where they brought the first infected before anyone knew better. It's gonna be overgrown to shit. Awesome. Worst case, look for ambulances. They're contained and I've gotten lucky before. Good idea. Swift. <laughs> See you back at base. Soon, I hope. Yeah. Surgery, trauma, ICU.
Jake, I don't think I'm going to make it home. I'd give anything to be with you and Susie right now. I'm hiding with a few of my colleagues. The door's barricaded and those things are on the other side. Things were way worse than we thought. I'm pretty sure no one is coming for us. At least not in time to save us. I hope one day Snoop will get to you. I hope you and Susie are really... I love you so much, Scott. Shit. We had no idea what they were up against. This doesn't look so bad. <clears throat> oh, of course it's blocked. It's gonna be too easy. Surgery then. Trauma center's gonna be in there. I'm the last of my squad. Everyone who came down here with me is dead. We secure most of the doors, but some are out of reach. Really, the overall forms of affecting patients. We didn't anticipate this kind of resistance. I thought they were sick and weak. I didn't think I'd see them rip my men apart. I have several bites of my arms and leg. I'm going to take a few more of these fuckers out until I get my last few bullets. Then I'll go join my squad. If you find this, know that you will need to send more soldiers to fully secure this area. Though well, hopefully, you blew this building. <laughs> <coughs> to Kingdom Kong, and you weren't dumb enough to try to contain this thing. Good luck, assholes. You fought the good fight. Are they really going back in there today? Every time, only half the squad returns. We lost the lab. It's time to call out. I'm sorry for passing notes like we're in high school. I just don't trust these soldiers listening in. I have no idea what's going on. Why don't they get us out of here? They keep saying evac is going to happen as soon as they make sure the building can be contained. I mean, are they seeing or hearing what's going on down there? We've lost it. I think it's not about containment. I think it's about protecting the data, the research. We need to get out of here. Our friends might still be alive down there. You've seen what those things do. No one could have survived it, not for this long, but it sucks that they're dead. 
What are you suggesting? I see Scott fighting with the soldiers. He's more than fed up. We can't. We get him and look for a way out. Let's give it one more day to see what the new soldiers do. One day, then we act. Thanks. I'm glad I wasn't around during the outbreak. Okay. That's it for The Last of Us 2 today. We'll be back tomorrow. Thank you for watching. Y'all have a nice day.